I am planning out a manuscript, a book, that is the closest to my own experiences as a torture survivor and someone with resulting DID, like Dissociative Identity Disorder, of, of any other book I've written except the, the previous version of this book that, um, that didn't get sold, even though some editors said yes, sales team said no. So I am rewriting it to be closer to my experience, and that means that I am writing fragments of my own trauma history or I'm well at the moment I'm planning it all out chapter by chapter and I've only I've only actually written three chapters but I'm planning it all out and I know certain things that are going to happen and it's hard because it means I'm having even more flashbacks and every time that I write a manuscript like this where I'm drawing on my own trauma like scars and stained I am reliving the trauma memories every single time I write and edit the manuscript like scars I did like 50 edits I think before it got published and that's hard, but by the end of it, I have worked through some of it a little more and am a little more desensitized to some things, and that's good. I do like that my books can bring healing or hope to other people who've gone through similar things. Like, that matters so much to me. And the most reward for me is having people, readers, tell me that my books have helped them in some way. Like, that's the reward for me. Although it would be nice if I was also earning a good living from my books, but it means so much to me that my books help people. But while I'm writing them, it's a little hard sometimes, and I'm finding that right now, but it's worth it to me. It's worth it if my books bring healing or hope for others. And it's what I want to do. It's my voice.